six meter long hello bar circular section has 140 mm diameter for a length of 4 meter while it has 120 mm diameter for a length of 2 meter first of the bore diameter is 80 mm throughout as shown in figure so to find the elongation of the bar when it is subjected to an axial tensile force of 300 kN take modulus of elasticity for the bar material as 200 gp first of all write down the given data for that so first of all for member ab for member ab we we'll consider it is 1 so it will be external diameter it is given d1 is equal to d1 is equal to 140 mm 140 mm and then small d1 it will be small d1 is equal to small d1 is equal to 80 mm 80 mm then length l1 it is given l1 is equal to 4 meter convert it is in mm that is 4000 mm then next a1 calculate a1 is equal to for hollow circular section the formula it is so area of formula it is for hollow circular section is pi 1 pi into pi into in bracket in bracket d1 square d1 square d1 square minus small d1 square minus small minus small d1 square divided by 4 divided by 4 divided by 4 so pi In bracket, d1 square it is 140 square. 140 square. 140 square. And small d1 it will be 80 square. 80 square. 80 square divided by 4. Divided by 4. Divided by 4. It will be a one value to be get from this. This pi into one forty square minus eighty square divided by four. That will be ten point three six seven five. Ten point three six seven two into ten raised to the power three. Ten raised to the power three mm square. Mm square. Okay. So now. For member BC, for member BC, for member BC, BC, for member BC, for member BC. So D2 it is D2 is equal to 120 mm, 120 mm, and D1 is uh, D2 small D2 it is 80 mm, 80 mm, and L2 it is. L2 it is two meter, so convert it is in mm, two thousand mm, two thousand mm. Okay, then calculate area for that. So A2 is equal to A2 is equal to pi into pi into D2 square. A pixel D two D two square D two square minus minus a small small D two square and a small D two square divided by four divided by four. Divided by four. Divided by four is equal to is equal to so pi into 
point point in bracket so external diameter will be 120 square 120 square minus 80 square minus 80 square <coughs> minus 80 square divided by 4 divided by 4 divided by 4 So if we is equal to if is equal to six pi into one twenty square minus eighty square divided by four. That will be six two six two three point one eight mm square. One eight mm square. So this one it is a one eight. Now calculate. Change in length delta L is equal to delta L is equal to the modulus of elasticity is also given capital E is equal to capital E is equal to the same modulus of elasticity for AB and BC member it will be say 200 GP 200 GP so convert it is in Newton per mm square 200 into 10 to the power C you get in Newton per mm square Newton per mm square okay. so now change in length change in length delta L is equal to delta L1 plus delta L2. So delta L1 it will be PL divided by P1 L1 divided by A1 E1. Okay. So actually P value it will be same here. So P to be take common from this P and E it is also same for the A B and B C member. So E it will be also take common. E it is also take common. So in bracket L1 L1 divided by divided by K1 K1 plus plus L2 plus L2 plus L2 plus L2 divided by K2 divided by K2 divided by K2 Bracket code. So this one it will be PL divided by E. Okay. So P and E we are taken common form. Okay. So put all this value here. So it is equal to so P it will be 300 kilonewton. Convert it is in newton. 300 into 10 to the power 3 divided by modulus of elasticity it will be. Modulus of elasticity is 200 into 10 to the 200 into 10 to the power 3 divided by divided by L1 it is 4 meter that is converted to the mm 4000 divided by divided by A1 it is A1 it will be 10 point 10 point 36 into 10 to the power 3 10 to Power C plus 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 L2 it will be how much? L2 it will be 2 meters, that is 2000 mm divided by 8 to this one is 8 to divided by 8 to. Six two six two eight six point one eight bracket close bracket close. Okay. You get on this bracket. So first of all, find out three thousand into three thousand into ten to the power three divided by divided by four hundred into ten to the power three. 200 into 10 to the power 3. So this one it will be 1.5. 1.5 in back. Okay. In back. Okay. Now 4000 divided by 4000 divided by 4000 divided by 10.36 into 10 to the power 3. So it will be again 0 0.38. 0 0.386. 0 0.386 plus plus 